What is happening guys and welcome back to The Hunter Call of the Wild. Since the last episode there has been some changes, some welcomed changes, I must say. I have purchased the weapons packs 1, 2 and 3. I didn't purchase the shotgun one because to be honest, I'm not saying we're never going to use a shotgun but I'm primarily going to be using the rifles so that's, that's the reason that I went for one, two, and three. And the gun that I'm using is this one here. I had a look through some of them. Um, where's, where was the other ones that I seen? I think it was this one here that I seen as well. But I decided to go with this gun here. And the compatible items for it is the polymer tip bullets and you've got the soft point bullets. I've went with the polymer tips because it's got better penetration and as you can see there on the right hand side it can take on quite a lot of the animals that are in this map. In fact all of them are in this map. So with that said I'm actually going to buy some more ammo for it and it's actually quite good. Um, it's a good gun. I have done some work away from the recording I actually killed a black bear that had the fur type cinnamon and it was a really really nice looking animal if I'm being honest. I didn't think that they had different fur type, I thought that the fur type was sort of more of a common, uncommon, I didn't know it was, it sort of expanded to different colours if you like. Very nice bear it was though. But what we're going to do today, as I said in the last episode, that we were going to do some of the missions, which is exactly what we're going to do. Um, hopefully we get quite a bit of money for doing this, because the grind in this game is is good, to be honest, but it's very, it's very time consuming at the same time. So I'm going to head to this waypoint and then from there we're going to go up to Hope's Camp and we're going to see what we can kill along the way. It's probably worth mentioning as well that this is the main gun, the one that we've just bought, but this gun here is our original rifle, and I am keeping this to take on the smaller um, animal, well I'm saying smaller, like for example the deers and things like that, I'm still going to use that for the deers, um, but for the black bears and the moose, the the big gun with the, the polymer tipped bullets is the one that I'm going to be using. Right, it doesn't look like we're too far from Hope's camp and I've not seen anything at all, to be honest. There was a moose call, but of course because we don't have the moose um, lure, we're, we're sort of relying on seeing the moose before it sees us which unfortunately wasn't the case, it seen us and it, it bolted, so that was a bit of a lost cause. Now this camp should be here somewhere, presumably we need to find it and amongst these trees it doesn't look like a big area, so it should be relatively easy to spot I would think. Try sort of in the close. middle, there we go. Hope mentioned seeing some tracks in the mud. See if you can find them. To take out your camera, hold X, use LT. When ready, press RT to take a photograph. What do we need to take a photograph of? Have I missed that information or? I don't think I did. There was tracks here actually. Don't know what it's wanting us to take a picture of. Let's exit camera mode and find the camp first. Ah, there we go. There's red up there. There's red over there as well. I bet that's what it's wanting us to check. Yep, there's something in that tree there. Let's 
let's put this away and why can't we why can't I check that it's not letting us examine it for some reason let me try these ones nope this must be the camp over here so we'll check this I don't know what it's wanting us to take a picture of yeah I think this is a camp, there we go unless we need to find the camp first and then follow the footsteps Great. snap some pictures for the record and see if they lead anywhere there we go right there we go so hopefully the pictures that we have took up oh, there we go level up what's this that's a skill point so again we want to go for the in fact do we want maybe the um no we don't want the ambush we want the stalker what can we get right the track knowledge reveals information about an animal's gender when investigating footprints and vocalizations I'm only happy when it rains, decrease your visibility in foggy weather or exploring in the wild has made you a survivor so gain a 15% increase in health I'm not going for the health because I'm hoping to not get into any sort of danger that that we would risk losing our health I know that's, that's probably not going to happen but that's why we have a rifle so we can go for this one again, which would take us to level 2. Increase the distance at which tracks are visible and highlighted. That one doesn't sound too bad, actually, if I'm honest. Reveals information about an animal's gender when investigating footprints. I suppose that would be good for the likes of the deer. Yeah, let's go with this one. There we go. Right, hopefully we can track these footprints now. Which we still can't, actually. I don't know what I'm thinking. I don't know why we need to examine them when they're already highlighted. Probably should have thought about that. I don't know why I didn't. Right, this is where we've first seen it, so let's follow it past this tree. And... It seems to stop at the tree, actually. See, we can't have it on the phone. So we're just going to have to run straight down here and hopefully we pick them up again. Yeah, definitely human. Looks like a troublemaker then. Now I don't want you to go picking any fights, but maybe you could follow them and see where they lead. I was at a loss there for about 15 minutes because the footprints actually stop after this tree but I wasn't paying attention because on the phone see it says follow tracks to investigate but beforehand it says take a picture of the the tracks which of course I tried to do and it didn't register them but obviously that bit that you've just seen there that the footprint there that I've just went and taken a picture of that did register it. And no more tracks, huh? Well, just leave it for now and I'll see what I can come up with. This will help though. Thanks. There we go. And ju just at that, we've got a black bear there. She is up there. Is that her? I think it is, I think she's resting. Let me just get out the binoculars. Spot animal. Very easy, she's resting. Take out our gun again. I would try and get closer, but I'm not going to. Let's shoot her in the back, as unfair as that is. No, nope. Ran out of breath there. Couldn't get the shot away. 
because it was a bit I wasn't lined up properly I don't like this fog is that or there? I think it is right so let's try this again there we go this was with the big gun but I think we might have been a bit too far out so let's just see what damage that's done if any here we go I think it done quite a bit of damage vital organ hit just now I think it went this way there it is boom first kill with the gun and I think it is one of the cinnamon ones again it was blonde this time so we hit it in the right lung, flesh, whatever that says, vertebrae. Pretty decent shot, actually. And it's worth 1,258, which we will be taking. Taxidermize it? No, I don't want to do that. I think you only really do that with the, the sort of mythical um, levels and things like that, based on what I've seen people doing anyway. So, with that done, actually, let me just see if there's any other missions that we can do. Is this the one that we've done? Find three footprints from three different black-tailed deer. That should be easy enough. Right, guys, I've literally been running around this map for about 25 minutes, and these are the first deer... Oh, what's this? This is the first deer tracks that I've seen. And we need to find three of them, and I think it's the black tail deer that we need. And this is a white tail deer. Of course it is. So, I think I said that this was going to be easy enough to do, but I'm kind of wishing I never said that, if I'm honest. I've found plenty of these black bear footprints. Plenty of them. But we'll keep looking. We'll get there. We only need to find three of them, so... Hopefully, we'll get three of them found quite quickly. Here we go. Hopefully, this is black tail. Yes, there we go. That's number one, actually. Let me just check this, see how close it is. Oh, this happened just now. Where's the wind? The wind's behind us. So, oh, put your torch off. I don't actually know if the torch makes a difference to the visibility of the animals like for them to be able to see you I suspect it probably would but I don't actually know let me just see if I could find this deer though we may as well take a shot at it if it's close is this it here? no it's not I thought that was maybe the deer there but it's not here are more tracks and it is a black tailed deer but I don't actually know if this is the same one that we were just tracking. How I take it you don't know Let me just see. What does it say on the phone? We've only found one. So this is obviously from the same deer. I think what happened is that halfway through tracking this we track the rabbit instead and then obviously this is us just coming back to that so that's fine we'll head over here so that we know that the next lot that we see isn't from the same deer we just stumbled upon this little camp here with one of these let me just see where we are that's where we are on the map right down in this corner there we go 8 xp i'll take that Still haven't found the second lot of deer trails. I think this is actually the same one. We've been tracking it all the way up. Not on purpose. It just so happens that it's, we've taken the same the same line as it. But hopefully it's somewhere near. Because if I do see it, I'll just be taking it out. In fact, it might actually be just over this hill a little bit. Let me see. No. What are these though? More tracks. 
there's another black tail deer. And what are these? There's another black tail deer. Boom. So, find three footprints from three different black tailed deer, which is what we've already done. Anyway, guys, with that said, I think I'm just going to leave that episode there. Um, like I said, we only managed to get one kill away, but we did get a couple of the missions done. So hopefully, yep, yeah, we're up to six and a half thousand. So, pretty productive in terms of money coming in. Not very productive in terms of what we've killed, but... I think that's just the way the game goes sometimes. So with that said, guys, I hope you've enjoyed the episode and I hope you will join me in the next one.